You know, because he's like, build, do, a, do things for free, build a brand. And I was like, what if I did that with my coaching business? This is what I believe. I'm sharing that with you for nothing. Just get out there and succeed. My free real estate coaching program, you know, I do seven figure a year income with free coaching, right? Because I'm building a brand and I get, I get book sales, I get speech deals, I get sponsorship deals, you know, companies come to you and say, I'll write you this check if you, if you do this or do that. So the thing is, is that any business is a people business. I don't care how you slice it up. Even if you're in real estate investment and you're not even dealing with consumers, you're dealing with investors and you guys are just buying places like this and doing this, you're still dealing with people. My real estate business was built on giving, my, giving property owners in my area all the market information for free. A weekly email every, single, every, every same day of the week on the same day of the week every week forever. Closed sales, new listings, you know, anything. And a lot of agents were like, why are you giving them all that? They're not gonna have a reason to call you. And I said, well, I don't want them to call me to ask what something closed for. I want them to call me when they're ready to buy or sell something. You know, but look, when you give people more, here's the thing about free. If you go to somebody and you say, you know, hey, I want to help you for free. <clears throat> that's going to let them, that's going to make them let their guard down for just a second because everybody has these, these guards up because all these people trying to charge you and scam you, right? So they got their guard up. They don't want, you know, they don't want any of that. So I, I show up and I say, hey, I'm going to help you for free. And they, say, they say, wait a minute. And they let their guard down for a second just long enough to see if I'm telling the truth. Because a lot of people say, I'm gonna help you for free, you come into my little funnel, and now we're gonna try to sell you something. I tricked you with the free thing, now I'm gonna try to sell you something, right? But when you say you're gonna do it for free, they come in and then you really do it for free, now their guard is completely down, now they love you forever, now they're gonna do business with you for the rest of their life, with whatever you're doing and now you're connected with them because you gave them something for free, <laughs> right? Well, th when you tell people your secrets, you know, there's that thing, you know, oh, only 1% is gonna do it. That's fine and dandy and that's true. But let's say 100% of them do it. It's still enough. It's still yeah. enough, yeah, right? It's still enough, but I'll tell you, I tried paid coaching like I was charging for six months and I realized that was the wrong business model. And uh, I had already, my, 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 my thesis was relationships over transactions and businesses unlimited from day one of the coaching. So I already believed in that, but I was trying to build a business. So I was charging for coaching. Um, but you guys know Gary Vee. Yeah. yeah. So I, at the time, I was probably a year into his content. I was probably a year into his content where that's his thing, give for free. And so I started to think about, wait a minute, something clicked and I was like, I was listening to him, I was looking at my coaching business, I was thinking, what if I did that? You know, because he's like, build, do, a, do things for free, build a brand. And I was like, what if I did that with my coaching business? And so it took me several months to wrap my head around it because I was making 10,000 a month automatic money from the coaching students. But the thing is, I only had 200 and I wanted 100,000, you know? Right now I'm up to 27,000. But yeah. A lot of times the mistake, and I'm guilty of that myself, is you think you free stuff, but people don't want it. <laughs> you know, so you gotta make sure that it's the free stuff that people want. Exactly, exactly, exactly. It's gotta be, it has to be good stuff, you know, because then you're building a brand around crap, you know? Yeah, they're just, yeah, no, no. It, it has to be, you know, like me, for example. Just think about it. I got in the business, made a meal, lost it, okay? Worked my way back up, made it to the top again, then waited three years before I wrote a book. A lot of coaches in the real estate industry, they've sold for two years, sold 19 properties, and now they're a guru selling courses. Every industry, right? They, they don't have any clout. They don't have any credibility, okay? So when a guy who has been doing this 18 years, 
makes it, loses it, comes back, makes it again, keeps it, and then keeps it, and then it even goes even higher. That guy is telling you what he thinks about the world. People are listening, as opposed to a guy that's been doing it two years and you know barely sold any property and hasn't even you know hadn't even been through a market crash. I know how to handle a market crash. I know exactly what to do to make more money when the market's crashing. Real estate commissions, not investing and all this stuff. Real estate commissions. So. Yeah, exactly. It's got to be good stuff that people relate to. They need to, you know, be able to relate to it, and it has to be something, some nuts and bolts, some usable material that they can take back to, into their business and their life and use and be productive. I have a quick question for you. On your weekly email, you talk about giving market updates and things like that. What would you suggest for somebody in the market the size of the market we're in? Because there's so many different market trends inside yeah. the same city that you what you're going to do what you're going to do is you're going to make a, a different web page on your websites for each area or each trend and then within that email that goes out to the whole market you're going to have this little section where it's like yeah. here pick your area or whatever and it's going to go to the web's web page that, and they can say oh i'm in this area that area they can pick their area you know the email is kind of general it's talking about this some new listing some some self-promotion i sold this or listed that and you got this box that has the different areas they can just click and once they click on their area boom now they're in your world of, of that area where they got a link that goes to the new listings in that area the closed sales on that area information they can search in there whatever you want on that page whatever you want them to see but that makes it to where it streamlines it to where now we can scale our business we can scale it now because now we're not sending one email to five different groups we're sending one email to everybody now we can scale it to yeah as many people as we want I mean, this is some epic shit man okay.